All right, guys, what are you? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Woo. This is the first time they're gonna actually get to see what my face looks like whenever you mess up. <laughs> Cause, cause... What's up, guys? Jay's Two Cents here, and Nick and freaking Phil. Today we're gonna make fun of your Craigslist ads. <laughs> Probably not your guys' specifically. I hope some of these people are watching. I <laughs> know uh, it's making fun or gonna give me a headache. We interrupt this video to bring you a special message from iFixit. No, we interrupt this interruption with this interruption. That new stuff from iFixit. Wish you didn't grab this card, but inventory sucks. Fix the inventory problems with iFixit. Whoa, don't drop it. Can't fix that with iFixit. Just kidding, yes you can. Wish you could take iFixit with you anywhere, but your pockets aren't big enough. Introducing the new Moray. And the new Nino. Take them with you anywhere. So get iFixit for your loved ones, or just get them for yourself. So we've been obviously covering graphics cards and CPUs during this pandemic and all of the craziness ensuing in terms of the astronomically inflated overpriced pricing. Something like that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna kind of bounce around the, the nation here and some of the major cities and we're gonna see what some of these Craigslist ads look like. I know I'm not the first person to do this. I'm well aware that other channels have done the reacting to Craigslist ads. We've reacted to your setups, but now we're gonna to react to some of the just clearly clueless, brainless, living on another planet type people that are out there. So speaking of clueless, brainless people, let's start at the Inland Empire here, shall we? So let's go ahead and, I live in the Inland Empire, so I can say that. Yeah. <laughs> let's just go Anyone ahead. that's lived in the Inland Empire can say that. <laughs> oh, stuff. the very first ad looks like it was taken in our set, even though it's not. Look at that. With the, <laughs> that's, I'm not scalping, I swear. It's not me. Good oh. gaming PC. I'm just going back to console because I'm used to it. Who says that? Ooh. You know what's funny is first, actually the price doesn't even seem terrible. It's 800 bucks in Riverside, granted if everything works. It's got a GeForce 1070, mm -hmm. okay? No, it's got a GE Space Force. You know what, you know what's funny is uh, runs clean and fast. It's better than runs dirty and slow. You know, I looked up the price of 1070s individually right now and they're still going for like 500 bucks. In a vacuum, that sucks, but... <laughs> but the in the current yeah, state of affairs. It's actually not that bad. Okay, well, you know, maybe that was my listing then because it's not stupid. <laughs> 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 AMD powered office PC gaming computer, 300 bucks. It's a 6356 core CPU. Dude, we're going back to like old school Phenom 2 right there. Um, that's not even Phenom 2, it's FX. Duh, Jay, you're stupid. I should put on screen <laughs> pictures of all of us from when that CPU was new. Dude. Just to show them how old it was. <laughs> Maybe there's not that many PC listings for the IE because it's the IE. We're, yeah, we're <laughs> all right, here we go. We're going to Los Angeles now. Oh, right, here we go. High-end gaming PC with an FX8150 <laughs> in Simi Valley. Oh, Simi Valley. The cesspool of Ventura County. Okay, so it's an 8150 eight core. Now that's the same, that, I had an 8120 when I started my channel in uh, 2012 and it was already a couple years old by then. <laughs> Actually, it, started, it came out in 2011, yeah. the CPU. So it's a 10 year old CPU. It's got an HD 7970 and he's calling it high end gaming PC. Gaming PC for sale, 2500 in Los Angeles. Oh, hey, that's your case, isn't it? Yeah, that is my case. Is this your ad? Is this your ad? Yeah, no. except with less vape juice. I have better, I have better fans. <laughs> and I don't have a front panel. 2,500 bucks. It's an Intel i7-5960X. So yes, that was a thousand dollar CPU back when it was new in like 2013 or 14 or whatever it was for fifth gen. It's got a 1080 in it, non-TI. 36 gigs. How do you get 36 gigs on that setup? What? Of RAM? What? Maybe he means 32? What? No, I don't even think it was 2,500 bucks when it was new. Like 2,000 then? Oh, here's the thing, look. He's got four sticks of RAM in there. So he doesn't have 32, 36 gigs of RAM. He has 32 if they're eight gig sticks. Yeah. So he can't even math right. Don't buy a, a gaming computer from someone that can't math their RAM. Anyone on here that's like, I know what I have. It, what they have is delusion. Total build cost 1700 plus, asking 975. Spec, it's a Corsair carbide. A 6700K quad core. 64 gigabytes of G-Skill Rip Jaws. Wow. It's a 1080 for the win graphics card. So it's an EVGA card. Dude, so for $1,500 less than that other guys, you can get a computer that destroys it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I mean, for 975, given the current state of affairs, this might not be awful. 12 core gaming workstation PC for 700 bucks of Westminster. Okay, it's a 3900X 12 core. Whoa. Okay. I mean, that makes it worth it already for 700 bucks. Yeah, you're right. Holy crap, I didn't even think of that. 
Uh, it has no graphics card though, because- Okay, that makes sense. They clearly took it out or something. No, wait, there's a graphics card in the picture. Yeah. It's an MSI like RTX police, card. Yeah, yeah. yeah so he, 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 he scalped his graphics card yeah. and now he's selling his system because he's like, oh, I couldn't find a card. Shut up. You. Okay, here's the thing. The $700 price for the tower with the RAM and the 480 gig plus three terabyte plus the case plus the power supply, it's not a bad price for 700 bucks. And the, and the three terabyte hard drive as well? I, I said three terabyte. You said 40. It's just the principle of him I said 40 plus three terabyte. It's yeah. on the recording. Someone do the instant replay, please. It's the 40 gig plus three terabyte. It's still in new condition, used for a new. I couldn't find a graphics card, so I'm selling. Yeah, because he sold a 2080 Ti to try and get a 30 series and then couldn't score one. That's what probably happened. So we're only ripping him for pretending like he didn't clearly uh, scalp his card. Yeah. Oh my God. Just buying a CPU and Who puts an 8086K in this case? He wants 2,900 bucks for two 1080 Ti's and an 8086K. There's the crackhead of the award, uh, the award for the biggest crackhead of the day so far. Crackhead of the award. Shut up, the, I get the irony, Phil. <laughs> I speak dyslexic, okay? Wait, what, the what'd you see, blacked out what? Right there, blacked 6800 out. 6800 XT, all blacked out gaming PC, $5,000. What? It's a Lee and Lee O11 dynamic. It's a 6800 XT plus a 5800X EVGA Supernova 850. Uh, 32 gigs of rip jaws. Dude, there's nothing special about this. $5,000? All right, we have a new crackhead of, a crackhead of the award yeah, award. We have a new crackhead <laughs> of the award. <laughs> okay. You know the irony about it being in Placentia? Is this person should have been the placenta and thrown away after the birth. <laughs> <laughs> Fully loaded gaming PC, all new parts. Nothing is used. Okay, how uh, it's, it's an up. Intel i5-4590. NVIDIA GeForce 450. What? All parts brand new, never used. What? No. <laughs> I think we have a new crackhead award. It's Las Vegas though, so. <clears throat> oh my God, a, a copy of Enter the Matrix? Yo, that game that was That game sick. was so bad, dude. It's so high <laughs> really? Yeah, dude, it was I played that game, dude. So did I, but it doesn't mean the fighting was good. It was so annoying to deal with. Dude, does the world really repeat itself that much? <laughs> are there three Australias? Um. <laughs> I was like, what are you talking about? And then I looked up and it's like... What's the crazy part of Florida? Pick. Isn't it like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, there were two listings for gaming PC. Oh, $7,200. $7, oh, jeez. It's an Acer Predator pre-built. Completely wiped and refurbished, lightly used and bought a year ago. Willing to negotiate trade. Retailed for nine to 10,000 online on Amazon. All right, so this is one of the 3090 uh, for the Win 3 cards. And you can see by the notch right there how it's almost centered. That is a 20 series card. So I do believe that's a 2070, I really do. It's got a clear yeah. CMOS button, that's kind of nice. It also has well, a clear wallet button. <laughs> you ripped off. It's an Intel, clearly. Dude, even the RAM doesn't have heat sinks on it. Dude, that's like, that's the rip off of the century right there. Florida Back man. The award. Florida man strikes again from Sebring, Florida. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> um, so it's Alienware and it's still overpriced, but 2300 for a 2080 Super at this point? Or 2300. Th this actually doesn't seem like a bad deal. I was going to say, I was like, that's actually not bad. So let's put this in perspective 20, 2808 and 2080 Super. <laughs> okay, so they want $1,000 for a 2080 Super right here by itself. Looking to sell my MSI 2080 Super Gaming X Trio because I got a 3080. It's only been used a year. Asking a thousand or best offer. And it was funny, that's not like ridiculously scalped. That makes this PC for 2300 bucks not terrible. Who would have thought Florida would have been the reasonable one? It's like yin and yang, right? It's like there's a really insane deal and then there's also an actually balanced. surprisingly decent deal, yeah. That's not bad. 1100 for a 3080. I will ship only, no email. Sounds like <laughs> scam to me. Oh, yeah, that's scam AF. Yep. This is a real card. It is not a picture. <laughs> it's a box of a card. This is a real card, not is not a picture. Be prepared to have to sign for this UPS, USPS package as there is no cheap product and I want both of us to have a safe transaction. That sounds super like, dude, I'm not sketch, you're sketch. I'm protecting me from you, bro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my oh God, no. I made the earth oh bigger. No. <laughs> this actually isn't awful. A brand new RX 6800 XT with a 9700K gaming PC for 20,000, uh, 20, 20, $20.99. I thought New Yorkers would go, I can't do New York accent. Yeah, I can't do that. <laughs> it's like, no. Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs>
I'm getting good PC deals here. Let's look up New Jersey. Oh yeah, duh. Yeah, right across the river there. You know, they're, they're crazier. High-end gaming PC, low price, 2400. Has a 9900K. 2080 Ti hybrid. What the heck? Why are all these reasonable? Stop. California's <laughs> the drunk one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I told you the OC was the, the OC was almost as Florida as Florida, and then everywhere else in the U.S. is normal. I want to move suddenly. Oh, oh Bakersfield. Oh, geez. That is the that is the hickest part of California. Let's see, gaming PC. There's only like two people listing stuff in Bakersfield. Like these are all the same guy right here listing yeah. the same thing over. Thirty six hundred dollars. What? For a 3900X with a Noctua cooler, thirty two gigs of RAM, a thirty ninety Trinity. Wait. What? <laughs> Where did he get one? It's Bakersfield, dude. Like <laughs> they mined one. Yeah. San Francisco area. Oh. Lightly used PC gaming rig for sale. Never really found the time to use it between work, rock climbing, and classes. So I'm selling it. But the the graphics card is not listed. See, this is the stuff you have to look out for in these listings. Yeah. Cause look, the, that first picture prominently displays the graphics card, which is sketchy. Yep. So you're gonna go and pick it up, and if you're not paying attention, then you're, he's just gonna make uh. And if you're like, where's the graphics card? Oh, it's, it wasn't listed. Here's the thing, if, if you're building a gaming computer and you're like, I have everything I need except a graphics card and I just wanna play games right now and you only care about 1080 Ti, or 1080 Ti, 1080p, I mean, for 390 bucks, it kinda sucks, but you could be up and running if the card works and you know at least be like, okay, I'm playing now. I mean, 390 is a bit expensive for a used, you know, two generation old card, but I mean, look, this guy wants $750 for his in Alameda. Oh, it is a whole PC with a 1070. Okay, just go buy that one then. <laughs> so anyway, if you guys are wondering why prices are just out of control like they are, allow me to just bring you back to SoCal here uh, as we go ahead and then take a look at what the prices of graphics card used are right now. And here, we'll just go back to Inland Empire. So let's look up 2080 Super. All right, so see, here's a RTX 2080 Super for 850. You know what, that's not, that's like retail. Honestly, that's its yeah, MSRP. Wow, yeah. Um, that's gonna sell quick. Thirty eighty. Two thousand dollars sealed for a vision with two thousand dollars sealed with receipt. That's the same one, huh? Probably. Five three thirty sixties for four thousand. Yeah. How this guy get five from the exact same? Right. I mean, I thought these places had limit buy one per household or whatever. Right. And this guy's got five from Zotac sitting right there. Cash only meet inside lobby of police station. <laughs> You've got front desk duty at the police station, right? Yeah. You're sitting there behind the glass and two dudes walk in with a box, exchange money and they walk away. Yeah. Would you be like, hey, what's in the <laughs> what's box? The, yeah. It could have been drugs. Okay, NVIDIA RTX 3080 FE for eight, for $900. Something is up with this ad. Currently in hand and ready to ship ASAP. The reason why these people wanna ship, guys, is because they're not gonna ever arrive. Okay, they're gonna get all you super excited people to be like, I found one that's not super overpriced. And then you're gonna send the money and the card's never gonna come. They're gonna do it 20 times. They're gonna make 20 grand off of you. And then they're gonna disappear. That's what they're gonna do, promise. If they're not selling it in person, tell them to go pound dry sand. Here's a 3070 for 1400 FE. Oh God, <laughs> Look, a 3060 Ti for 1300. <laughs> free chairs. Oh, no. <laughs> free chairs at Micro Center Tustin. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Guys, send us your listings of the most ridiculous ads you've ever seen. On, I know that there's like subreddits for this sort of stuff, so just comment down below with what the most ridiculous thing you saw was while I go ahead and go tally up how much money in graphics cards I have over there and start adding some to this, I guess. <laughs> Just kidding, I can't do that. Not because the brands say I can't, but because I won't. On sale today for 1200. I'll do a thousand cash now. Cool. <laughs> no, 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 money, I want your hand, give me the money. I'll demo it to you. Adding 10%. Okay. Fire pays fees. <laughs> okay.